Hi, today I'm here to show how you can import data from Raven Pack Analytics into the MATLAB environment. To use the API, you need to go to File Exchange first and search for Raven Pack Analytics. Then download the API. There are two options here Toolbox and Zip File. Let's select Toolbox since it is much easier to use. Once we finish downloading, we can easily install the toolbox. And there is a getting started file for you to learn the basic information and how the toolbox works. For the toolbox to work, it requires MATLAB R2018A or later, data feed toolbox, and the credentials provided by Revenpack. The first step in importing data is to establish a connection to Raven Pack Analytics. Now we have connected to Raven Pack Analytics. As you can see here, the credentials that I'm using contain only test datasets. In fact, when you connect to Raven Pack Analytics, you will see many datasets available since there are many countries and securities. The next thing we need to do is to map company names to Raven Pack IDs using entity mapping function. For example, we can map Tesla to DD3BB1. We can also map multiple company names using the same command. Once we have the Raven Pack ID, we can use it as an input for requesting the dataset universally unique identifier or UUID. Now we have the dataset UUID here. We can see the details of requested dataset as well as previewing the data inside. The final step is to download the data into MATLAB for further analysis. To do so, we need to generate the token using dataset UUID and time periods that we are interested in. Then convert the token into URL. Last, use getData function to retrieve the data into the MATLAB workspace so that you can do further analysis. For example, visualize data and determine if the factor is a leading indicator of stock price or not. In case that you are interested in other interfaces, please visit the data feed toolbox product page. Thank you very much.